After you have completed the required configurations within your public cloud accounts, you can now connect to or onboard those accounts into Prisma Cloud. Start by clicking Settings in the vertical menu on the left side of the admin console. Select Cloud Accounts. To onboard a new public cloud account, start by clicking the Add button. We will use AWS for our example, but notice that there is support for Azure, GCP, and Alibaba as well. Provide a name for the new cloud account. So we'll go ahead and actually modify the name here. In addition, we need to specify if we want to monitor or monitor and protect for this cloud account. Monitor and protect would require read and write permissions for the cloud account and allow for auto remediation of policy violations. In our example, we'll just go ahead and select monitor the default. Then click next. On the next screen, the first value we want to enter is the external ID. The external ID provides the trust relationship so that Prisma Cloud can access your AWS public cloud account. Secondly, we want to enter the role ARN, our Amazon resource name. This is the Amazon resource name that is created when you configure the Prisma Cloud role in your AWS account. So enter a valid role ARN. And I'm going to go ahead and copy and paste this. So there we go. We have a valid ARN. The ARN also incorporates the AWS account ID, so we don't have to enter this separately. And then as soon as we're finished, we can click Next. In this next step, we have the option to associate this new account with an account group. You can use account groups to combine access to multiple cloud accounts so that you can manage administrative access to these accounts from Prisma Cloud. When you onboard a cloud account to Prisma Cloud, you can assign the cloud account to one or more account groups, and then assign the account group to Prisma Cloud administrator roles. Assigning an account group to an administrative user on Prisma Cloud allows you to restrict access only to the resources and data that pertains to the cloud accounts within the account group. Alerts on Prisma Cloud are applied to the account group level, which means that you can set up separate alert rules and notification flows for different cloud accounts. So we'll go ahead and select Account Group. And when we're finished, we'll click Next. So what is happening here is that Prisma Cloud is attempting to connect to the AWS cloud account with the credentials that we provided. And that will initiate reading the APIs that are necessary to ingest the data and logs describing your AWS resources. The status of each category of ingested data is now presented. So it looks like we've had success. We've got a, a green check mark indication that we've had successful connection to the VPC flow log ingest. We're not implementing inspector or guard duty on this account, so those are kind of hashed out. And we also have a successful connection to config ingest log as well. So therefore, the connection attempt was successful. And you can now see that I've added AWS in the list of cloud accounts to the table. And it gives me the status and the fact that ingestion is enabled right here. And that's how you onboard your AWS account into Prisma Cloud.